New tonight, a major business announcement in Prince George's County. A company called Local Motors is opening its first location at National Harbor to debut its fleet of 3D printed cars. Rachel Sherrod takes a look at how this technology could transform the area. It may look like a vehicle you'd see in Back to the Future, but Local Motors, a company based in Phoenix, is bringing its fleet of 3D vehicles to National Harbor. John Peterson is with the Peterson Companies. Dad or mom or the kids can go up, hey, let's go pick out a car, and then the next weekend they can be helping put it together, all in the same facility. The announcement comes on the same day as Local Motors unveiled the Strati at the Detroit Auto Show. It's the world's first entirely 3D printed vehicle that can be manufactured or printed in just 24 hours. In that one movie, that one woman said, you complete me. Well, they complete National Harbor. People here got a close-up look of another vehicle called the Rally Fighter. It's the world's first co-created vehicle built by 7,000 people online. It, it, is a, it is a revolutionary shift in how people think about the economics of producing vehicles. The National Harbor facility is expected to be built in the coming year, creating more than one 100 jobs with a lab, showroom, and assembly floor. Prince George's County officials hope it'll draw even more innovative companies to the area. But 100 jobs that are connected to the type of retail manufacturing could easily translate through multiplier effects to three or 400 jobs. In National Harbor, Rachel Share, News Channel 8.